All right, Captain Startel reporting once again. Captain's log start date now. Center of the universe happens to be right here. I'm here with the beautiful Maria of Walsenburg, Colorado, and I uh, just stopped to check some directions and uh, happened to stop right in front of Brothers Organic Garden Supply. Yeah. Maria came over to say hi, and we just struck it up, and she goes, wow, well, my store is Organic Garden Supply, and it's perfect for the movie because what I'm doing is traveling, uh -huh. highlighting uh, organic uh -huh. movements, um, helping people get gardens planted, and doing the medicine work on the land, education, yeah, to show people what's right about the world. and entrepreneurs that are getting the message so yeah if you would real. if you would give us a tour around your store I would, I would love, love to, to share it with people I would love to do that. thank you and what is your name darling Maria and Annalise look this is Annalise, Annalise? that's he's my sister-in-law's name he's doing a picture right now of us so we're gonna go inside and you're gonna pay attention to hi me. Annalise nice Let's to meet you just for a minute okay peace of mind okay. organic amen I roots know. organic ladybugs we found the kingdom of heaven yeah, so we just opened this a year ago. And the reason why we opened it is because no one was serving Southern Colorado with the medicinal marijuana. And my husband is so, at first, I really was, I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't against it, I've never been against pot. But I was so, the fear, the fear, cause I'm in the older generation, our generation is fear of the, mm -hmm enforcement the government and i just want to shake so, your hand for the older generation to the younger generation and say yeah. thank you for all the work you've done yeah the girls between us women between 40 and 60 we're dead afraid of the government and the officials we're afraid of them because because they've been beating you down yeah they've been beating us down for so many years a lot of women even quit yeah, yeah. or a lot of women that i work with now in their late 40s 50s 60s mm -hmm. um I, we're all they're all incognito with me yeah because they're in fear still they got that locked in fear right so it's kind of sad thank god my husband's really young and i'm a lot older because it not because they come to me not wanting to go to my husband right right yeah, yeah so i say no honey stop it because it's not no longer illegal yeah go look for it i don't know go look for it along the curb right there Calvin. well on behalf of all the medicine people on the street all the people of the world on behalf of the God and goddess that, that live in the garden, I just want to thank you for standing yeah, up for what's yeah. right, for standing yeah. up for the medicine to the people, because that's what it's that all really, about. You know, I, I swear, I swear this to all y'all out there, I'm 48 years old, and yeah, thanks, I <laughs> But let me tell you, my doctor had me on um, freaking <clears throat> Prozac crap, right. antidepressants. Right and um, high blood pressure pills, mm -hmm. off. Wow. Hash pills, I'm off, baby. High I'm five. Off. Yeah, I don't, and I can work, I can punch, I run two businesses. And so I, I really do believe I'm very mad because I'm living proof that it is medicinal, it is. I don't take high blood pressure pills, I don't take freaking Prozac or anything. Amen. I take a half, yeah, amen, I take a hash pill 100% organic no after effects, no side effects, no nothing. I just get to chill. I don't have the shakes no more. I don't have high blood pressure no more. I don't have anxiety no more. Oh, I man. chill. Oh, I just got yeah. the chills. And look at how up. beautiful her eyes and her skin yeah. and her face is. Yeah. Look at how, no, yeah. how, you know, and people that are on mm, prescription teeth. pills don't look like that. Yeah, I yeah, can tell no, right honey. away, sister, in someone's eyes and their yeah. face. I don't have, I don't have, you can see my pupils. Yeah, beautiful, you know what I'm saying? gorgeous, yeah, you bright can see white eyes. I'm not tripped out Very or clear. I'm not, I'm not sluggish. I'm not, I'm chilled. Hey, I'm chilled. You know what I'm saying? So. I say, I amen to Jaja, the yeah. mighty lion. Yeah, for real. I and I continually, you know, Bob Marley had it right. It was really, it was cool. It's cool. And so me and my husband, it was actually my brother-in-law who came from North Dakota. And me and my husband always want, my husband is the grower. What's your so husband's name? My husband's name is Pete. Pete. So he always wanted to do this. Yeah. He's a grower by nature. He's Amen. a farmer. Awesome. Big, you know, lettuce, take yeah. it right out of the freaking ground, clean it off and munch it, right? Yeah. So my husband's that guy. So he, it, yeah, he's had a big issue since day one about the it being illegal. Yeah. Big issue. He's like, really? Because... He, my husband don't drink, he don't do drugs, no pharmaceuticals, no nuts. Just keeping it natural. Yep. Keeping God's it medicine. Organic. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. And my, I have, you know, 
I was straight for 15 years. Uh -huh. Once I started, but um, once I started, uh, I, I mean Annie, once I started uh, getting anxiety mm -hmm. and high blood pressure, and they put me on medicine, uh, my husband just fought, 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 right? He's like, babe, please. And I'm like, I feel it. I'm sorry. Ended up in the hospital. I'm not kidding. This is a true story. I ended up in it. the hospital with the anxiety attack, ready to have a stroke, yeah. got on high blood pressure, because I'm really not feeling this community, because they're so, like, behind the times. Everybody's afraid to say I smoke pot. Really? Why? It's legal. It's legal. Why, why Get your afraid? permit. Claim your rights. Claim Stand your right. up yeah. for what for, for what your generation and the generation and before. Actually, your generation for generation. what your generation fought for right. with their lives. And we're still hiding incognito. Well, I only do now because I own two businesses, and it's hard. It's hard for me on that side. On mm -hmm. this side, majority, they are under the understanding, right? Right. I own a salon, so I have a variety of clientele. I have to be incognito because for that reason. Yeah, you do. Which is it doesn't make any sense because I'm like really if you knew, if you all my clients knew that I take hash pills, THC, so I could function normally, because of my menopause or whatever. I'm like you wouldn't be so against it. Well, you got a powerful. Uh, so what's the word? Lectern there. No, I'll you learn. got people no, in I your lose. chair. I really? Lose. Yeah, I lose. But you, I, I know that you're spreading the word. Look at this, people. It's she's spreading the word. So she's working incognito over here in the salon, just loving people, making them beautiful, yeah. and making them go home feel feel that much more beautiful. Yeah. And keep it on the down low. And yeah. then right here, we got the new world. The new world order, right? right? right. Of plants and medicine. Yeah, all your beautiful, stuff, your pots. beautiful organic certified seeds, you guys. Organic yes. seeds, my organic seeds. My husband's organic all the way. No GMOs up no in this GMO. joint. No. Sorry. <clears throat> and we don't. Yeah, we you'll see organic, and my husband's really stressing the fact that we're going to stay organic. Amen. We're not going to feed the. Thank earth you. Earth. We don't want to. We don't want all you people out there who smoke in pot to be smoking chemical chemicals. Pot. I know. Screw we, that. I want that to be clean, straight pot. Clean. Take a couple tokes. You're good to go. Chill out. Mm -hmm. Clean hash. Clean whatever. They don't want to choke out when you smoke. You gotta go organic because that's the way. Because. Why would we be doing it if we're going to throw a bunch of chemicals? I know. I can't stand it. I'm not in it for it. the money. We're not in no. it for the money, people. We're in it because we're better people with it. Amen. For real. We Amen. are. Yeah. We are. We're, we're, we're strong people. We're united. Yeah. Not to are. mention, I mean, so over the next few years, you guys keep doing this work and you're going to be owning this town. But not not in a bad way. You know what I mean? Yeah, you're you're, you're pioneers yeah. here in this area. You yeah. heard the calling. You came. Yeah. And you're pioneers. Stay, yeah. And because your intention is for the medicine yeah. and the intention is for the love of the people, well, you have to set up a business to provide for your family. That ser This service that you're providing the community is literally the best service that you could provide yeah. at all is yeah. the medicine. And you're... I just honor you as medicine people and, and tenders really of the garden yeah. and suppliers of the of the good wares that are needed. It is. And to, to keep spreading that message of organics, no chemicals. No chemicals. Because we just get so much healthier. And no matter what you grow, I, I'm, 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 not <clears throat> just, I'm not just saying this for the medicinal cannabis. Mm -hmm. I'm also saying it for, look what's happening the, the prime example is the cantaloupe in Rocky Ford. You don't want to eat oh, it. Oh, I know you don't want to eat it, but look at all those farmers. You know what? Last week I, ho I overheard two women at the grocery store uh, uh -huh. mentioning getting sick after eating cantaloupe the day before. Yeah, so we're going, I'm not only saying cannabis, grow your own. I'm saying grow your own lettuce. Come on, you guys are living out there. Grow your own tomatoes. Grow your own. Grow your own. Uh -huh. Right? That's the movement, and that's grow what I'm out here own. Yeah. Uh, my journey is to film and meet people, do medicine on lands. I get called from place to place to place. Do you? And uh, yeah, I ended up here for six you, weeks. If I told you the whole story, it'd just trip you out, sister. I got uh -huh. I got pulled off the road to do some medicine, to do a big ceremony. Uh -huh. And I lit a big fire on I-25 in a big old dead tree, you know, called me and said, okay, this place needs some fire, you know. And uh, well, they saw the fire from the highway, arrested me. I went into jail and I told them I'm praying on the land here. I'm praying this is public land. And it was public land. In, the, in jail, they said the owner of the land was listed as John Doe. 
they couldn't figure out who owned the land, whether it was public, private, federal, or nothing. And I said, see, I was told to go to this land and pray that it was okay. So anyways, long story short, I end up in jail, meet some cool people in jail, the way it usually happens, walk away from the charges like I told them I would. And, uh, and the lawyer ends up being an old family friend, puts me up at an organic farm outside of Trinidad. And then I get done with my court case and I meet a guy, Moose, here in Walsenburg. And I get pulled into Walsenburg to do some more work because it's, like you said, some nasty old stank energies around here Yeah. that need to be moved along. You know, these spirits are just wandering in circles and they're needing somewhere to go and something to do. So I have a call out right now, too, for a lot more medicine people to come into this area. Bring us your business, though. I'm not kidding. Only because I'm not saying I'm being trying to be greedy or want to promo my business. No, but team. we no, please right now because this is the I'm opportunity. I'm right here. I'm right here. I I'm the closest place and the cheapest place. I'm sure of that because I price check because I'm mm -hmm. in business. You know? I'm the cheapest place all the San Luis Valley, Alamosa. So the whole quarter, the best the place whole, in the region. The best place in the freaking region. You can order whatever you want here. Awesome. I'll deliver it. Awesome. Everything. And you can't come here for your business. I can give you whatever you want. We have a cell phone number. We do after hours. If awesome. You need anything over a hundred bucks, and you're coming from Trinidad, Lahana, Alamosa, Monta Vista, La Vida, all this whole surrounding area. If you're coming from out of town. So like a hundred mile stuff. radius, you got. Yeah. At least. At least all the way around. I'm like, well, why don't you come bring your business here? What, awesome. What is it that you right? Yeah. Give us your business, cause we're opening for you because this is for the people of the new world right. there's all kinds of gardeners on right. their way yeah. we got a place up on uh comanche up there in like by la Veda. Yeah. and i know the guys up there support your business here that he jay said he, this is the only place he goes uh -huh. and um See? so we're you know and i invested a little bit in their garden up there so they can expand their operation yeah. the intention is to get an edible uh, apothecary you know an edible kitchen production unit going to make cookies really? and brownies and tinctures and well, i work me off the camera i can tell you some stuff all right all right all right so star child signing out it's yeah. been a blessed meeting Peace here out, with maria Organic garden supply let me see a card in there you go this is what's up y'all yep brothers yeah. organic garden supply our business is growing 719-989-8033 of course my magic number yeah 725 main street delivery and setup available walsenburg colorado 81089 i just want to tell you this is your full service 24 7 <clears throat> garden supply store <clears throat> maria and her husband are here for you and your needs for all the people of the planet to get the medicines that are going to heal the people and bring across a whole wave of peace and freedom to the land so come in and support brothers organic supply star child signing off peace and love